Hey, this is Eric. I've got a quick tip for you today on how to work on your chord transitions. Uh, what you want to do is you want to take the song that you're working on and you want to play with the recordings. I can't stress that enough. Play with the recordings, not just on your own. And what you're going to do is you're going to try playing along with the song and you're going to try simplifying the strumming pattern. So if the strumming pattern is something like this, What you want to do is you want to simplify it, maybe just strum once per chord, so it would be something like this. The trick is if you do it along with the recording, you can improve your chord transitions and you can add the strumming later. That's it.